Hello, I'm Graham Roberts. We're going to do a short recording to show you how you can create a new project in NetBeans. You go to File, New Project, and you want to take the default. If the default's not there, that is, it's the wrong default, um, you want to go into Java and Java Application. We're going to create a project with a form. So, for this reason, we want to actually give it an appropriate name. So I just call it project form at the moment and I'm going to take off the create main class you can see it's not checked here because the form will create its own as it is inherited from JFrame in the swing library okay well that will do so we click finish and there we have the project in the project you'll want to have the JFrame form. So we're going to right click on here, ask for new, and ask for the um, JFrame form, which is here. We're going to give it a name. So I'm going to give it a name of um, form bits because that's what we're going to be looking at the controls on the form. I'm going to give it a package called project form and you could have given it a default package which is here but it's best to give it a sort of name really um, and in real life people tend to put the commercial entities put their web address there so I click finish and we get the form interface here in this panel and the source code in here you can see the source code has got its own main function so we, that's why we didn't want one created for us um, we we're already going to get one created for us and here we can see the extension from JFrame and the constructor is here and in it there is um, the initialize of the components the components that it's talking about are the components you put on the form here well one of the components we might want to put on the form um, in order to see something happen would be say a text field radio button um, and a button and so on but we'll look at that in another video that is how you can create a Java form in NetBeans